Well, most of the companies that we talk to are interested in growth, and really uh, the growth engine for the economy and the growth engine for the government is really immigration. And if you just look at the facts of the multicultural consuming audience today, if you look just at the foreign born, forget about the entire ethnic population, it's one in five, which is equivalent to the size of the population of Quebec. And then from a growth perspective, you've got another 300,000 new immigrants coming to the country. Every four years, that's a million new consumers. And when you're in search of growth, it's a huge opportunity. I think by default, a lot of um, the folks that have attended look at product development. Uh, as a, uh, a means to create that relevancy. And our message, I think, to a lot of the attendees would be that, um, yes, that is absolutely a means of creating relevancy, but there's a lot other, uh, many other ways, even simpler ways to create that relevancy, whether it is pro uh, packaging innovation, whether it is customer service, whether it is marketing and advertising, uh, customer experience, uh, distribution, there's many, many ways to create that relevancy with the ethnic consumer to uh, continue to drive growth. And I think my takeaway is the message we talked about that it's not multicultural marketing, it's that the market is multicultural. So when you look around, it is the growing multicultural population, but mainstream Canadians today are going to ethnic grocery stores. What before used to be, oh, that's ethnic, sriracha sauce is ethnic, what is that? It, you tell my kids, they don't realize that it's an ethnic food. So the bridge to mainstream and the relevancy, it's all become uh, one.